Assalamualaikum and hello YouTube. My name is Nur Muhammad from Anywatch and I'm back with another a uh, not a stripe review, not a watch review, but a polishing cloth. This is the Cape Cod metal polishing cloth that I've used uh, quite some time ago. So, but mine uh, have dried up and I bought a new one because I needed to polish one particular watch, which is this Proxima Scuba Master Professional, right? So, you can see here at the back of this particular watch, it's kind of scratched up during the uh, transportation. Yep, so you can see that tons of different scratches here so i'm going to be taking some photos for you guys later on to you know um to uh make a diff uh, to show you the difference between um before and after the polishing all right so yeah you guys know that this is a quite a famous <laughs> material polishing cloth um, popularized by uh, the urban gentry right so tristano tgv from the urban gentry he used this thing and i thought that you know what let's just uh, do uh, use this thing again to let's to see if i can polish out as much as uh, scratches as possible on this particular watch right so i've got mine from um timezone to you.com so if you guys live in malaysia so this uh, i've i've got mine i i've got from their shopee uh, shop online or you can just go straight to this time zone to you.com so depending right so but of course if you guys don't live in malaysia or in any part of southeast asia you can also always get this from ebay and stuff so please do shop around right so may, uh, this thing is uh priced at about 20, uh, about 10 us dollars about ringgit malaysia for to ringgit um it has two pieces of um, of polish, polishing cloth inside it and yeah very very nice see soft moisture cloth with a pleasant fragrance so i can't show you how does how the smell is but yeah still okay so let's uh you can see that on this particular watch there are a few scratches on the top of the case bag and on the dolphin itself and on this um bottom bottom area so i'm going to be polishing that and we shall see later on okay guys so i've take just one bit or one piece of this uh, uh of this polishing cloth so it has two big pieces inside there so i just take one bit of it because i'm not going to be using all of it right so and yeah put it on this bubble wrap and i've taped up the this particular watch because i don't really want to get the uh, this surface here uh, scratch up so we only want to work on this particular side and on this particular side and later on i'll show you how it works right so what you want need to do is just gently give it a quick uh, rub here so see how it would uh, affect this uh, particular area so see how it goes later on but i will not show that in the whole video because it would take quite some time what but i will what i will do is show you guys uh, before and after uh, picture of this uh, particular watch after we've uh, worked around it for a while right so you can see when i brush it so it will come out with this black right so that is the metal surface that is being um, polished out right so that is normal guys so don't freak out and yeah we shall see i will tell you guys how many minutes did i take to to polish out the scratches here but yeah i will come back i will pause the video and we will come back later okay guys so after 10 minutes of <laughs> polishing and cleaning all the gunks and all the um, excess material that has left after the uh, polishing process so you can see that the scratches still remains but it is not as uh, deep as before right so this happens because that particular the um this cape cod metal uh, polishing cloth is basically scraping off the finer layer just a fine layer of the of the metal that is available on the case bag and thus reducing the intensity right so the deepness of the scratches so you can see that it is still visible but not that bad as previously so i have managed to smoothen these scratches on this part and also the scratch on this area and also in on the dolphin side of course i will put a before oh sorry this here i will put the before <laughs> before before picture and after picture uh, or was it? it should be here right so <laughs> so sorry so before here and after is here so you can see the difference is a bit 
there is a bit of difference but don't expect a miracle to be had when you are using this type of uh, polishing cloth right so what do you guys think of this particular uh, watch uh, polishing cloth so i think it is a handy tool to have but of course don't expect miracles so you have to work uh, quite a longer time of it it is this, this is after just 10 minutes i'm pretty sure if i rub it uh, more maybe like half an hour so yeah we you will get a different reason all different result altogether but yeah still a very very nice and handy uh polishing cloth to have right so what do you guys think of if you guys what do you guys think of this particular video or if you guys want to see more future video reviews such as this such as this one please go ahead and give me a comment down below if you guys like this video please give me a thumbs up if and if you want to see more future video reviews such as this one please go ahead and subscribe to my channel until next time i'll see you soon stay safe and bye bye